Hey guys, what's up? It's DS44, and today I'm going to give you a tour of the tank that I made called Sand, called Sand Striker. So, first I'll show you the main cannons. These two, and those two back cannons, the farthest away, they're called Scorpion Cannons, well that's what I call them. And then we have these cannons, which can be activated on the second level. I have them on both sides. I have the exact same um, type of cannon and base on every side, so if you cut this in half, it would be the exact same thing on the other side. So I only have to show you one half, but I'm going to show you the whole thing because, yeah. So then these activate those cannons, which go crazy far way out of my distance, which I will show you. Amazing. This scorpion, this sand striker tank has amazing distance, which you will love. And yeah, so if you're going far, like super far distance, way out of your world, you just want to hit something random, then build this and activate that cannon. I will be making another video showing you how to make this tank. Yeah, but, and yeah, so, um, I will now show you the three levels of the tank. So first level is the main level, which I can activate the scorpion cannons, these two levers, and it activates all the main cannons, the two front cannons there also. You have your storage, which is also really good, and um, I'll show you the second level now. So you don't really need a ladder there, but I just put one there. So second level here activates as many shot cannons, whatever you like to call them. There used to be a door there, that's why there was a lever there. And I'll show you what they activate. So they those levers inside. See that lever activates this cannon. And I will show you the last level. So up here, you have to activate this activates those cannons, and I, for some reason, I don't have any levers there, so I will just put those there, and that is it for this video. Thanks for watching, and see you next video. Bye!